Welcome to this short video that explains team praxis and how it will help you build better understanding between project and program team members. The world of project and program management is well served by standards, textbooks, methodologies, and bodies of knowledge. They all assume that there is one way of interpreting their content. But that is not the case. In reality, we are all different and each of us interprets good practice through our own lens. For us to be effective as individuals and for teams to work well together, these different perspectives need to be understood. Praxis uses the DISC model to highlight different individual perspectives. This emerged from the work of William Marston published in 1928. He identified two dimensions and four quadrants with terminology that has evolved over the years. Traits that are outgoing and task-oriented are referred to as dominant, while those that are outgoing and people-oriented are called influential. Those that are reserved and people-oriented are said to be steady, while those that are reserved and task-oriented are conscientious. Each of us can demonstrate multiple traits, but our personal combination means that we perceive and apply the components of good practice in different ways. DISC is arguably the most common psychometric model used today. It is the basis of many proprietary assessment tools, and that's why we've chosen to use it in team praxis. Most DISC-based assessment tools use colors for the four types. These vary, but the most common ones are red for dominant, yellow for influential, green for steady, and blue for conscientious. For the key functions and processes, team praxis provides an insight into how each of the four profiles will interpret and apply them. For each profile, starting with conscientious and dominant, the team praxis page indicates how they would interpret the guidance and how their interpretation would be perceived by others. It then provides the same insight for steady and influential. As individuals, we will typically be a combination of profiles. Understanding these perceptions has two key benefits. Firstly, it enables each of us to reflect on our own style and strengths in relation to those of others and consider different ways of working. Secondly, it enables each member of the team to better understand their colleagues' points of view and the team's collective interactions, leading to enhanced performance and less conflict within the team. Team praxis is an important component of both the individual and team paths within the praxis pathway. To learn more, Please use the QR code or follow the link in this post.